हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी विल सी अबाउट प्रिंट स्ट्रीम क्लास इट इज़ आल्सो अ पार्ट ऑफ जावा आईओ प्रिंट स्ट्रीम क्लास प्रोवाइड्स मेथड्स टू राइट डाटा टू अनदर स्ट्रीम सिंस द प्रिंट स्ट्रीम क्लास ऑटोमेटिकली फ्लश इज द डाटा सो देर इज नो नीड टू कॉल द फ्लश मेथड सो देर इज नो नीड टू कॉल फ्लश मेथड and there are many different methods that are used in print stream class such as uh, public void print boolean b public void print character c and so on so there are many methods that you can refer with the documentation of print stream class here i am showing you two different examples in first example we will try to Uh, write the content to a file using print stream and in the second we will see how we can format the text using printf method so the structure is already created so now if i have to write the content i have to create an object of file output stream so here i am creating file output stream object f out is equals to new file output stream and suppose i have to write in the f1.txt file then create one object of print stream class print stream p1 is equals to new print stream and associate that f out object with the print stream class so associate it like this so now if i have to actually write this print 400 so i can write this ab kya hoga isse jab main print ln method ko call kar raha hu so this print ln method actually automatically flushes the data in the file output stream object so the values are now getting writeed in the f1.txt similarly i can write or flush p1.println string values this is very convenient way of using or uh, writing contents to the file moreover the print stream methods does not throw exception so here i am not actually using try catch but the in case there is an exception i am using throws exception here so it is perfectly fine in the end just close the methods uh, objects p1 and f out So this is how you can use print stream class to flush the data in the file next you can also format your data as you have to uh, as you are very much uh, pretty much familiar with formatting in the uh, c or c++ programming so, uh, it is done like this suppose there is an variable int i is equals to 5 then instead of using system dot out dot print ln i can use system dot out dot print f and format it like you used to do in the earlier programming languages like c or c++ percentage d comma i so now it is a formatted output using print f method present in the print stream Uh, it is a method which is uh, present in the java dot io dot print stream class. So you have to actually import java dot io package. So this is about print stream class. Thank you for watching the video. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel for more tutorials on Java and other computer science related subjects. Thank you.